Breaking news, Nigerias. Good news, it's angry Nigerias. As Tinubu, federal government, unleash major initiative to transform households across Nigeria. So my people, my people, no be today, Nigerias, they don't they hear good news though, concerning this administration no. But as it come out, now only a few people, they benefit from Amo. And you see, say, some of these politicians, they still they use them. They do their own, no. So my people, my people, may we come here at this good news matter, it can follow. In a significant initiative, aim at addressing food inflation and supporting citizens. You see, say the federal government of Nigeria, it can commence the sale of subsidized rice on Thursday in Abiokuta, Webi Ogu State. The program was officially launched by the Minister of Agriculture and Food Security, Webi the person of Abubaka Kairi, who can emphasize that. This initiative na part of a broader strategy to provide relief to Nigerians where be said they face economic challenges. You see, say during the launch in ceremony, Kayarikon represented by Mrs. Tony Ayo Ajayi, the state director of the ministry, he can highlighted the government's commitment to ensuring that the rice distribution is conducted with transparency and fairness. He constated that various federal agencies are actively monitoring the process to guarantee security and integrity in the distribution of the 50 kg bags of rice, which have been sold at a subsidized price of 40,000 Naira. Kayari detailed the purchasing process where requires buyers to present their national identification number, where be NIN, and an automated Teller machine, ATM card. He can express appreciation for the effort of Auguste Governor, where be Dapo Abioduo, recognizing his leadership in facilitating the smooth implementation of the program across the states. He can make a clear say Ogu is one of the first states to benefit from this initiative. So he can thank the governor's tenacity and visionary leadership. Now, so Kari can make a clear. You can see say of a truth, the minister can praise the organized distribution framework established in Oguo, ensuring that the rice reaches all three senatorial districts and effectively reaches grassroots communities. You see, say, it can urge citizens, say may they support government's efforts, emphasizing the need for collective action to appreciate and uphold initiatives aim at enhancing food security. In his remarks, so, Governor Abiodukon commended President Bola Tinibu for his commitment to tackling food inflation and improving the livelihoods, that is the livelihoods of Nigeria. So he can acknowledge the president's unwavering support for the agricultural sector, particularly in light of the current economic climate. Abiodukon stated, though, 
said this initiative it demonstrates the government's responsiveness and thoughtfulness, especially after the removal of the petroleum subsidy. It was a talk of woe, but with the way Tinibu can they bring out this initiative, he should say of a truth. He will relieve people, especially those who be say he there for a good state, who be say this initiative, now there, he want to take place. Abiodu's appreciation can extended to the federal government for taking decisive steps to alleviate the burdens faced by Nigeria, so particularly during these challenging economic times. He can emphasize that initiatives such as the subsidized rice say not only provide immediate relief, but also it contributes to the overall stability and security of food supplies in the country. You see, say, as the program rolls out, it can reflect a broader commitment from the Nigerian government to tackle food insecurity and mitigate the effects of rising prices on essential commodities. So, the collaboration between state and federal governments is critical in ensuring that this effort translates into tangible benefits for the populace. The launching of this initiative can come at a crucial time when it be so many Nigerians that they're grappling with the effect of economic adjustments, including the recent removal of waste subsidies, which has contributed to increase living costs. The sale of rice at a subsidized rate is expected to provide much needed relief for families, so enabling them to assess essential food supplies at more affordable prices. You see, said the government officials have reiterated the importance of transparency in the distribution process, highlighting that monitoring mechanisms are in place so to ensure that the rice reaches those who need it most. This level of oversight can aims to provide mismanagement and ensure that the program achieves its intended goals of supporting vulnerable populations. So my people, my people, this initiative, now what is supposed to go around all the country, that is the state, so make it not be like say now only Ogu state, it go take apple, and at the end, other states, they no go call experience some more. Because if of a truth, rice, they can't sell them for 40,000, of which we all know say, the cost of rice now, now over 100,000, that's a big relief for. Oh. So my people, my people, the government no go only bring that one, to tell show say, now it ain't make things day easy for Nigeria, so make it try more to make sure say more initiatives come out where go give lasting solution to these economic challenges. So my people, my people, I wanna see the matter in not past like this. So this nabli channel, I be make on not forget to subscribe to this channel. I salute to now.